what I live for, people! Oh my goodness! If you did not see the Super Smash Bros. for Wii U Nintendo Direct that just happened, I literally stopped scream. I literally just came from finishing screaming the HMK hectic Nintendo Smash Bros. Wii U Direct party. The 50 fact extravaganza. Even though they did troll because it was like 53 facts, whatever. Oh my god, people! So many facts, so many things, so much hype to stay in one area. One, I like to get off my chest that with the 3DS version coming out, and it was like, oh, why would I get the Wii U version? And at first, I was kind of scared. I'm like, what would the Wii U version do to set itself apart from the 3DS version? Holy shit, Nintendo, you know what's up. You know what's up with the whole deal on how many people can play the game, the new features, exclusive features, what's to the Wii U version. Oh my goodness. So many trophies, so much stuff. And guys, let's get into it. Let's get down dirt to it. First and foremost, you can play with up to eight people in Super Smash Bros. for Wii U. The just the Wii U version, you can play up to eight people. And you have seven different controller types. You have the GameCube controller, the Wii U Pro controller, the Wii Pro Classic controller, the Wii Classic controller, the Wii Mo, Wii Mo and Nunchuck, and the Nintendo 3DS. Holy snap! And you can play up to eight people. But my good friend Sora Alam, he confirmed to me not too long ago before I went to this. Unfortunately, eight player matches are not co-op. I'm not so sure if it's that if that's the truth. I have not gone into it, but we'll have to see in the future. But apparently it is not co-op. But still, eight player matches is woo! We've got huge maps, we've got huge additions to the game, big battlefield, certain matches that can only be played on that, including layer matches, different areas, different lane matches. What is this Naruto Ultimate Ninja Storm, Mar Naruto Ultimate Ninja crap where you can play on one uh, plane and then other people can play on another plane where you get launched onto different planes to the Donkey Kong stage. This is, this is going to be the ultimate smash and we're not done yet people. So apparently we're going to have more people to play with from the beginning of uh, Smash Wii U, not the 3DS version, but you get to unlock more people, whatever, it's all good in the hood. And then we're gonna have more stages, more music, more options. The event mode that's gonna go on in this. It's gonna go, and I want event matches. I'm glad event matches are back. And apparently, there's gonna be an event match map where you're gonna have to go from different area to area, completing the certain uh, map requirements or whatever, and then you ascend. And there's gonna be a one player mode and a two player mode for this. And speaking of multiplayer modes, finally! Stadium matches with more than one person to either take turns or compete and cooperate. Like multi-band smash where you get to uh, go with all four people. Or home run contests where you can take up to two people or take turns with four people. This is going to be the ultimate smash people. So many features such as Palutena and Viridi and Pit and Dark Pit and even, maybe even Krom talking on Palutena stage. Holy damn. And then Temple returning, all this stuff. And the stage editor. You get to draw. Stages on your gamepad, like legit draw stages. Fucking yes! Yes! And then not only that, Smash Tour. That's the board game, people! It's been confirmed! Smash vs. Board Game Smash Tour. We take a tour of our board game and you get little fighters. You have fighters that, are, you know fight against you and then you have to go around the board getting those things that you got in Smash Run the little uh, power-ups and then if you collide against each other you guys fight and when you fight if you win you can steal fighters and the more fighters you have the more life you have when the time runs out and you play in that match at the end Smash Tour the board game oh my god that thing better be on fucking line and not only that we got crazy to um Crazy orders and master orders, where you get to get pick orders from the master hand or the crazy hand and pay for cards or pay for tickets. And if you complete that, you get prizes. And depending on the master hand or crazy hand challenges, you have to keep going and then fight crazy hand at the end, or you can do one by one in the master hand setting. And then we got multiple features such as a new master fortress thing when you go against the master core. We have the master edges, master shadow, master giant, master beast, and then we have master fortress where you actually get to go in the fortress and kill the little cores inside. What the heck? And the way that fucking classic mode works, it works off skill level where you have to attack or 
play according to your skill level will you defeat an enemy before you. It's so much energy, so much hype, so much shit for the Smash Brothers Wii U version. Oh my god, I can't wait to play this shit with you guys. Oh my god, capturing matches, everything. More trophies, a lot more trophies, a lot more music, about four times more music than in the 3DS version. And then we're probably gonna have up to a thousand trophies in Smash Bros. Maybe two thousand trophies? I don't fucking know. It's gonna be fucking huge. Holy shit. And now we didn't get to the park, which epitomizes the hype. Guys, at the end of the direct. Also, the Bowser Jr. trailer came out, and that shit was balling. I'm not gonna pull up here because I don't wanna get copyright claims in any way, shape, or form to this thing. But, damn, Bowser Jr. Calm your ass down, Bowser Jr. Holy shit. But the thing that got everyone hyped that made the internet blow up, Mewtwo is on the way! Mewtwo's on the way! Fuck! Yes, Nintendo just confirmed DLC. Mewtwo is a DLC character that's coming on the way. Spring 2015 for Super Smash Bros. Wii U and 3DS. And how do you get him? Apparently, you may have to buy him. But a special club Nintendo privilege will be if you register your game for the 3DS, register your game for the Wii U, you get the DLC from Mewtwo for free! And then, looking more into this, since Mewtwo is a DLC character, that's kind of like, if you're not a stage hazard or if you're not an assist trophy, that's fair game for nearly anyone, even if you're a trophy or not. So Lucas may come back? I don't know, something, because Mewtwo is already a trophy in the 3DS version, and Mewtwo is going to be a DLC character. Trophies no longer deconfirm things. The only things that deconfirm characters are assist trophies and stage hazards. And speaking of fucking stage hazards, holy damn, Nintendo is fucking pulling us by the fucking ears. Guys, Ridley is a stage hazard on Power Sphere, just like how Metal Face is a stage hazard on Goal Flames. On Power Sphere, Ridley will attack you, but if you smack around Ridley enough times, he will help you. But Ridley can't be KO'd like regular characters. You can actually knock Ridley off the stage and he will be KO'd. And if you KO Ridley, that acts as a point towards you. And what's more, if you go into the results screen, Ridley's face will actually be a life counter point if you killed him or not. So this guy functions like a fighter, he dies like a fighter, he's registered as a fighter, but he's not a fighter. Nintendo, what the fuck? Really? And now... And now... Oh my god. Tournaments. 64 player tournaments online. Yes! Fucking yes! This game is gonna be the optimal smash. Play online or offline, where friends are a lot are out there are friends with you at home. Keykeepers, good friends, hectic force, all those people fucking smash, smash, smash! Do you understand the hype? This fuck why I live for, this what my channel's all about. The fucking hype train that Nintendo has brought with Super Smash Bros. for Wii U. The 3DS looks awesome, it plays awesome, but the Wii U verse is blowing it out of the water. 1080p native, 60 frames per second. Oh my god! I hope you guys feel it. If you have a Wii U, there is no reason why you should not get this game. And if you don't have a Wii U, now's the time to get it. Black Friday, November 21st. I will see you guys on the battlefield. Until the next hype video, I've been HMK. Stay on the hype train, and the hype train will Get to Smash Bros. All of us will be together. Hector Force, I will see you there. Settle it, Smash.